What's going on, my guys? What's up, YouTube? Yeah, OG, back at you with another one. Yeah, we talking about for this two-time brother. Yeah, we are. But before I do, y'all hit that like button for OG. Respectfully comment, because you're going to want respect, because I will respond. I get back the same energy I get. And support me. Let's talk about this. I've never seen such an ungrateful brother in all my days. You know what you need to do for this two times? Don't respond no more. Cut him off. See, one thing about it is everybody wants to be the star for this. Yeah. Everybody want to be the star. In your show. That's all going with your brother. That's the only thing going to go on with your family. And I'm going to tell you youngers that's on that road to getting money, learn from it. If your brother need a job, let him be a roadie, they used to call him. Don't let him be no writer. Don't let him be no freaking rapper on your, on your um, tour. Nothing. Because you know what they're going to do? They're going to think they're bigger and better than you. Now, let me understand this. This guy is really known and getting views because of finesse two times. Secondly, he's eating off of finesse two times. He's probably riding off of finesse two times now. He been eating good, smoking good, drinking good. He been getting that little willy wet off of finesse two times name. Let me tell y'all young how I know this. See, it was a time deep down in the Delta that this area wasn't doing chrome and Craig. OG brought it here. OG was one of the biggest and most uh, uh, smartest and brilliant black businesses. I was the only somebody back then doing big wheels and I had the money and the equipment to stay up to date. I was in the game with 17. Was like, whoa. Yeah, that's what OG did. OG liked that beautiful stuff, just like he liked beautiful women. And you know what? I brought a lot of guys in. Because I make it, when I say real money, real money. And I brought guys in. I brought family in. And I let them and their whole family eat off my table. And y'all know what some of them did? Felt like they were bigger than my name in the business. They forget who was the asset. It was me. So you know what I'd do? Let them go and never look back. Because I was not going to let another black man, especially family, stunt my growth with simple, with, because of one simple situation of them being in their feelings, hating, thinking that they deserve what I got, or I'm supposed to give it to them. But next two times, don't owe your broke ass nothing. Stay your ass off, off the internet talking down on your brother because you're going to get hungry. Watch your mouth. You ain't got nothing to be way. Y'all trying to wage war against y'all successful family members and y'all can't even afford a damn attorney. Y'all make me sick. 